And tonight we have team coverage following that tornado in Bell County. Fox 7 Austin's Amanda Ruiz spoke with residents in that area about the damage. She joins us live with that. Amanda. Mike, like we've been saying, the damage here in Bell County is extensive. Even just driving down this road, you can see down trees, down buildings, and homes that have been leveled. Now, if you look here right now, I'm standing right by what used to be the Baptist Church here locally. Right now, you can see that there's chairs, there are foundations all down. This right here, in this area right here, that used to be where the wall was, and now it's all scattered across. And the pastor tells me that not only he, but other residents in this area now have a long road of recovery up ahead. A lot of trees and churches and houses and mobile homes is not there no more. A tornado ripped through this part of Bell County Monday evening. The path of destruction clear as day. I mean, they're all gone. Roofs gone, trees snapped, and items blown everywhere. George Chipman lives in the area with his wife and 22 pet cows. He says the damage to his home is fixable. We was lucky. We didn't get scratched. Other places like the first Cedar Valley Baptist Church down the street, not as lucky. The initial effect, of course, is heartbreak, but then the real outcome, I think, is, is it just makes us all stronger. Donnie Jackson is the pastor of this church and says it's been here for 15 years. The damage is extensive, almost half the building completely leveled. This right here is, uh, is some damage. It's something that we're going to have to deal with and rebuild. But that cross right in there is still there. That cross has been there from the very opening of this church. I think it's probably the least disturbed thing in this building. Jackson says they have a long road of recovery up ahead of them to rebuild this church. But this cross that sits tall regardless of going through a tornado gives him hope. There are some things that can be destroyed but the things of God cannot be destroyed. 